Hello everyone, welcome to my Nora Bay Farms here in Stardew Valley. My name is Melanie V. Thank you for joining me today. It is now the 27th of summer, year one. Let's check the weather report. It is going to be sunny tomorrow because it's the moonlight jellies tomorrow. And fortune teller for today is... Ah, good luck! Okay, so if you can look into the right corner, you can see the UI Info Suite mod is working again. Well, it's not actually the same original mod. Um, I actually had to find a different version of the mod. Someone uh, fixed it. I found this, uh, this mod on GitHub. So I was super grateful for that. So the original... Uh, mod creator i'm not sure if they're gonna update the mod but this one is working so i'm gonna keep using this one for now so let's harvest up all these crops and a lot of the stuff is not going to be ready again so i don't necessarily need to water them nope i don't want to eat the mushroom right now so, I will put this stuff away. I'm going to sell, I'm going to sell some of these blueberries. I don't need that many. Let's just keep 40 just in case. Is that good? And I will sell most of the cotton. I'm just going to keep five. Um, I don't think you can process it to make anything with it, so it's really not useful to save it. I will keep the... I'll keep some of these. I'll sell these guys here instead, the higher quality stuff. And I'll take one to George. So, George needs a hot pepper and discover the purpose of the skull key. I can do that. So, maybe we'll go to the mine today because it is a good luck day. What else can we do? Oh, I still need to bring Demetrius a melon. Oh, there's a lot of stuff I have not gotten done as yet. <laughs> oh, me and the these task. I keep forgetting. Okay, sell, sell, sell. Put this away. It's not in there. There it is. Okay, let me get out my watering can and do the few crops that I have to do. But first, I'm gonna give Tommy some water. Hey, Tommy. Here's your water. Oh, we got a couple battery packs here. It's great. And let's go water a few crops. So these ones are watered. The corn is going to be... Oops. The corn is going to go into fall, so I'll keep that watered. And my honey will be ready in two days. And sunflower, five days, kiwis, three days. Okay. I love having this mod back on. I missed it. I really missed it. <laughs> so it looks like it's also Jacob's birthday. I honestly, I don't know a whole lot about Jacob. So I don't even know what to get to him. So do we have any jelly we can take? I think I do have one in here. So I'll take that. I can take this. I think that's all I have to take to the community center. What should we give to Jacob? Let's try just giving him a sweet pea and I hope he likes it. And if not, we'll feel bad about it after. So I believe the barn is all finished. So let's go say hi to the, the coop animals, the ducks and the chickens. Hello, ducks and chickens. Love you lots. 
thank you for all the eggs. And we'll process these right away. And I, I'm going to eventually get around to, you know, I keep saying I'm going to do it, but I really am going to get around to uh, making some more space in here for these animals. And let's head down here to the, to the big barn. Robin's done it. So it's Saturday now, so we can go down to Marnie's and get a couple goats. So I'm going to do that right now. And then I'm going to check and see how much wood I have. Hi, Marnie. I'm glad you're at your desk and you're working. Marnie is so iffy with the, her schedule. Like, even when she's open, she's not always at the counter. She's kind of unreliable. Very frustrating. You know, on Monday and Tuesday, I know she's going to be closed. And I can deal with that most of the times. But when she's, like, on, like, the Wednesday or Thursday, and you go and she's just in her room, it's just like, Ah, oh, Marnie, get back to your workstation. Okay, let's get another goat. And I think I'm actually going to get the fish pond. Now I do believe for the fish pond I need... Uh, I should have said hello to uh, Jazz and Shane in there. That's okay, we'll get them next time. Um, I do believe for the fish pond I need to get... Hello oh, goat! Come back out here goat! I have to go inside and say hello. What are you doing? Get out here. For the fish fun, I need seaweed. I need green algae. I think it's five of each that I need. I'm not 100% sure. Now let's see if my pickaxe is ready. One more day. Okay. gonna sell the mayo here okay let's see how much stuff I have so I think I need stone and wrong chest I need the seaweed and the green algae for the fish mon okay fingers crossed that's correct so I'm going to head up to the carpenter shop. Hopefully along the way we can find some spicy berries. Because I still need a few more. Oh, here's a grape. Before I was all about the grapes. And now I'm just all about the spicy berry. But I got three there. Oh, there's a spicy berry. This is what I need. I will take that. Let's head into the shop. Oh, I should have brought my hoe with me. Well, hindsight. So let's construct another farm building. I'd be so annoyed if I got the wrong stuff. Oh, got the right stuff. There we go. So. For right now, I think I just want to put it here. I might end up moving that. We'll see. And she's not going to start working on it tomorrow because tomorrow is the festival. But that's okay. We forgive her. We know she needs to make it to the festival. Say hi to Linus. Hey, Linus. And I didn't bring any tools with me. I sh should have brought some tools. But I didn't. Okay, I'm going to check up here by the railroad station, see if there's any spicy berries up here. Come on, give me some spicy berries. I need to make some money. No, of course we be. Oh, there's one. There's one. Got it. I'll take it. I will take it. And yet another sweet pea. Um, I can head down. Shoot. Okay, Abigail. 
I will not miss the festival tomorrow. I might, if I'm being honest. Okay, so I'm gonna head down to the community center and put these two items into the bundles. And I need to go find Jacob. Give him a present. I don't really know what where he works. I know he's a mobile vet, but I don't know what that means. So I'm not sure where I can find him. Let's give this to this bundle here. So we just need four more items. Okay, and that's it for this one. So I need the bulletin board. Who has that? Mm, no, this is not Emily's. Oh, it's the chef bundle. Great. Oh, I need to bring a fiddlehead fern, Mackie roll. Okay, there's a few things I still need to, to get. Okay, today might be a really good day for fishing because, um, especially at the beach, because I won't be able to go down to the beach tomorrow because it's the festival day but let's let's try and find Jacob I actually don't want to go all the way over into East Scarp he really I really need to just get lucky and find him over here maybe the the map. Oh, it's working again. Let's see if we can find him on here. not seeing him I don't know if this map shows the residents of East Carp though it may not because it certainly doesn't have that area on the map itself okay so let's put some of this stuff away Grab out the fishing rod. And I have two spicy berries. Let's make those. Got the two grapes already. Hi, hey, Tommy. What are you waiting for, bud? Why are you standing there? Yeah, let's put the stone away. All that. Grab out my fishing rod. The good fishing rod. Put this guy away. And let's head down to the beach. I don't think I've got the Dorado either. No, I didn't. Maybe I can try to get that. Now, some of these fish aren't as important. Because I don't actually need them for the bundle, so I can always get them next year. Hey, Elliot. Let's see if we can hook our Dorado right now, though. Oh my goodness, on the first try. Oh, better not lose it. Hey, hey, you be good. You be good. We're friends here. I might even put you in my fishing pond if you be good. There we go. Got the Dorado on the first try. And that was the like lowest percentage fish in here. And I got it. That is lucky. 
considering how much times I tried for the tuna and I couldn't get it and here I tried for the Dorado once and boom we hooked it okay let's go down to the beach should have brought my hoe with me but I forgot that's okay so maybe I can head up actually Oh, there's some porridge here. Oh, I really wish I had my hoe. Let's see what fish is available. Just the... Just the starfish. And now the super cucumber is available. Another worm spot. This is killing me. Why didn't I bring my hoe with me? Grr. Okay, let's, uh... Let's head down here and... We don't have any trout soup, but I'm gonna make one attempt at crimson fish. See if we can't get lucky. Come on, crimson. I may not be ready for you, but I certainly want to attempt. Eighteen percent chance. Come on, bite. Oh, there he is. There he is. Ah, that, that, that wasn't even close. <laughs> oh, boy. I can get this halibut, though. Let's go for this treasure chest first, though. I love the treasures. Because you just never know what you'll get in them. There we go. Ah, another fire cord. I need to donate that to the museum still, so I'll keep that. Okay, one more attempt. One more attempt. Let's give this a go. Come on, Crimson! No, you are not Crimson. You're just a regular old halibut. But another treasure chest. We'll take that for sure. Okay, what did we get? I mean, I need iron. I do need iron ore, so that's good. Come on, give me one more chance at crimson, please. Okay, let's see what we get. Okay, a flounder. You know what? I'm done with this. Okay. Goodbye, Crimson Fish. We will see you next year. But right now we are heading. Let's actually go up to the mines and go down to level 100. See if we can catch ourselves a lava eel instead. If we can even hook the lava eel, I should say, because there's just so much trash. I probably should do some foraging around this area to see if I can't get some spicy berries. Oh, I still haven't picked that up, huh? I guess I should get around to it. Okay, so it's a 4% chance, so not very likely, but if ever I needed to just, you know, get a whole bunch of trash, this is just the perfect place to come. Come on, give me one shot at the lava eel. I just want to see if I'm even able to catch it. Come on, give me that lava eel. Okay, that's it. We're heading out. I don't need any. I don't need that right now because it refills your health. Oh, no, it's closed. So I'm going to head back. 
free as a mine card. Um, I'm gonna go into town, see if I can just poke my head over here and get lucky with some spicy berry. Spicy berry, where are you? Anything up here? It's really hard to see. Any spicy berries here? No, there's a grape. There's a couple grapes. I mean, there actually could be a spicy berry on here and I just can't see it. Oh, is that a spicy berry? Just, there, yeah, there we go. Another grape. Oh. You think some of the, there's a bit of glitch in this particular mod because it's definitely letting forage appear on like the pathways. Oh, here's another spicy berry, but you know what? I'm getting a lot of good forage, so I shouldn't complain. Down here, is there anything? Okay, so I am going to head back to the farm. I'm going to make these, uh, I've got three spicy berries, so I should be able to make 30 more of the summer seeds. Get those sold today. Get a little bit more of that moolah in our pockets. Very sorry, Jacob. I wanted to give you a present. I mean, I didn't really try that hard, to be honest. I should have tried harder. <laughs> Maybe next year. We'll do better next year. Okay, so let's put some of this stuff away. Okay, so I've got take two of you guys and two of you. Oh, three. Make those and sell them. I'm gonna put the fire quartz in for the chest for Gunther. And I don't need that in here anymore. I think I'm going to sell those. Do I need to donate any of these things even? Yeah, I'm going to have to reorganize my chest a bit. I don't need that in here. I don't need that in here. Just the fire cords. Sell some of this stuff. So I will sell you, 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 you. You, you, you. So this guy will keep the Dorado. I'm not sure which fish I want to put into my pond. Oh, I'm out of space again. Okay, so let's grab this guy out of here. I really need to get to work on another. I'm going to keep him to eat. Yeah. Okay, let's quickly... Sh Drop this last flounder in there and head to bed. Okay. Did we make some money? A little bit? A lot bit? Oh, that's pretty good. 8,000. Wow. I guess we did sell quite a bit of our crops that we harvested. And it's, of course, the festival. So we have, what is, this is his new on Info Suite. Robin will finish your new building in two days. That's cool. I love that. I love that feature. And it's telling us we will have a thunderstorm tomorrow. It's telling us the weather for the next day. I don't even need to look at my TV at all. Except I need to see the Queen of Sauce. Okay, and it's a lucky day. Oh my goodness, I love this new mod, actually. So let's look at the Queen of Sauce. Greeting, it is I, the Queen of Sauce, here to teach you another mouth-watering recipe. Bread. Ooh, that is fancy stuff. So we now know how to make bread. Let's see what's in the mail. And uh, Demetrius is reminding us of the Moonlight Jellies. Okay, thanks Demetrius, I guess. 
Um, let me put this guy in here. Got quite a bit of gold. Look at that. So let's go say hello to the animals. Hi, chickens and ducks. Love, 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 love. Thank you for the eggs. Okay, we'll get these processed right away. I'm not sure if the museum is open or not, but I want to get over there and try to see if I can buy some... Oh, wrong one. Put this away for now. Actually, I'm, I'm going to take it with me. I'm not sure what I can catch over by, not the museum, I meant um, to the aquarium. I need to go over to the aquarium and see what they have. So I'm going to take some of these fish with me to donate. I don't know what I want to put into my... Ooh... What should I put into the, into the new uh, fish bond I'm getting? Hmm. Should I put that Dorado in there? Okay, so I want to put the sturgeon in one for sure. But I don't know what else. I don't know what else. Okay. I'll grab one of you. Oh, okay. I think I'll put the rainbow trout. Yeah, I'll keep the rainbow trout and put it in there. I'll get all these other guys donated. Oh, I'm feeling... I'm not sure. I'm not sure what to do. <laughs> okay. Let's head over there. Let's just do it. We're gonna donate all of these guys. And Robin's soon gonna get started on our brand new pond. Let's see if there's any spicy berries up here. Oh, look at that. There's a spicy berry. I'll grab it on the way back. Just need to remember to come this way. Oh, I should have brought my hoe with me. Why do I always say that? I know I need to bring the hoe, but I always forget. And we have arrived at the museum. Oh no! We're just early, it's fine. <laughs> <laughs> but we can catch the octopus over here. So pretty much any ocean fish we can still catch over here. So I am going to buy the cookies. As soon as 10 a.m. hits, I guess. Are they all open at 10? Oh, no. Ice cream guy is available. Um, let me grab that. And I'm not even going to make an attempt at the octopus. Let's see what else is down here. There is so many, so many characters on the beach. Like, that's, that's crazy. They really don't say much, though. Just a few of them actually talk. Okay, let's. Get back up here and donate these fish. Open, open, open. There we go. So, so far we've donated a total of nothing. <laughs> yes, I would like to donate a whole bunch of fish, please. This, 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 that's a lot of fish. So, fills in the warden a lot. 
Let's head out. And let's see what we can buy here. Okay, nothing new yet. So let's go buy the cookies from this vendor here. And we'll head back to town. We're going to go donate these today. Yes, please. I'm going to poke my head up here, see if there's any spicy berries. This is really the last day for foraging, so. For summer. For the summer forage anyways. Then we're going to get the fall stuff, which would be great. Can't wait to do that either. Got this grape here. And get this spicy berry. We still have to wait one more day for our pickaxe from Clint because he is closed today for the festival. But that's okay, we forgive him. Let's check on our mushrooms in here. What do we got? Ah, there's quite a few good goodies in here. Um, let's grab them out and make some more of the elixir. Can I clear all the path up here? Not yet. No, I should get around to clearing more of the path up there but for now let's just get these made so i have do i need chanterelles for this i might need chanterelles as well yeah let's like it okay so we'll just store these in here for now And let's get another of these made. This might be my last one. Oh, there was an egg in here. What's that doing in here? I don't know. I'm going to sell it. Go sell that as well. I'm going to quickly head down to Cinder Sap and do a little foraging there. I almost sold the cookies. I was like, oh, should I sell? And I'm like, oh no, I just went specifically to buy that to donate it. I'm not going to sell it. I need to... Oh, I need to get the forage here too. Let me just have a quick look. Then I'll go to Community Center. Then I'll go back to Cinder Sap. And then after Cinder Sap, we will head down to the beach for the moonlight jellies. I like seeing my foraging levels and all my levels and my experience that I'm gaining. Oh, hey Sheila, how are you? I'm only sorry I was wondering what Sam could be doing on this hot day. Yeah, I think she might be slightly, not just having a crush. She might be a little bit obsessed because a lot of her dialogue is referring to Sam and what he's up to. Hey, Harvey. Demetrius, I have a melon for you, but I don't have it with me right now. Sorry about that. Okay, let's get this bundle completed. Children's bundle. A screen. There you are. Cookies. Bundle complete. What did we get? Oh, it's pretty nice. Three batteries. I'm not going to complain about that. Hey, Penny. 
Okay. So, head down to Cinder Sap for some foraging. Oh, there's Martin. Let's say hello to him. He's so hard to find. I sometimes take the bus here to check out books from the library. Good for you. Hey, Granny. Sweet peas are in bloom right now. Would you like a sweet pea? Oh my, it looks wonderful. That's very kind of it. You're welcome. And I replaced the sweet pea I just gave away. <laughs> check the trash real quick. And let's check this other trash. No luck there. Oh, there's Abigail. Where are you going, Abigail? Did you know that my dad loves aged Blue Moon wine? It's his favorite. Oh! Well, that's interesting. Because in the vanilla game, Pierre only likes, loves, I should say, one single thing. But in this version, he likes the aged Blue Moon wine. So that's great. So that's probably not something I'm going to be giving him because it's super expensive. But, you know, if I, once I become rich, maybe, you know, I'll consider it. But for now, yeah, that's not happening, Pierre. But it's good at least to have another option. Because in the base game, he only likes the, the fried calamari. Which is also hard to obtain. Oh, there is a spicy berry. We'll take you will take you and I saw a mushroom up here take that for sure and I should have brought my my axe with me get some wood <gasps> no spicy berry yeah Ooh, look at all these grapes where were you when I needed you before, Graves? You were just hiding down here? I should see what kind of fish are available. Oh, another sweet pea up here. Oh, there's so much goodies here. There's so much goodies. I'll just sell most of these. Just as is. Not turn them into seeds. Oh, spicy berry. Yes, okay. So let's see what kind of fish we have down here. So we've got rainbow trout dorado, and we also got the largemouth bass. Go over here. Oh, another spicy berry. Oh, got two that time. Well, this has been a very worthwhile trip. Lots of good items. And I'm going to go ahead and head back. I was going to go and head down to, to the beach, but it's still pretty early. So I might as... Oh, I'm lost. I'm lost. This forest is so large. Take that. That sometimes it's kind of disorienting. Ah, uh, another sweet bee. We'll take it. We'll just take it. Why not? Okay. And away we go. So I'm going to go uh, head back to the farm, grab my axe really quick, and see how much wood I can get until about 10 p.m. Then we will head down to see the moonlight jellies. Why are you hanging out over here, Abigail? Interesting. Oh! Traveling sales card. I forgot about you. You got anything good? Don't need that. Don't need that. Don't need that. The coconuts. Did we finish that bundle just yet? It doesn't matter. I'll Oh, I want to save my money for the 
seeds tomorrow. I'm sorry, I'm not going to get it. I don't need the coconuts because as soon as we open up the desert, we will have plenty of coconuts. Okay, let's go to this chest here, store, 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 okay, so we've got five spicy berries, okay, we'll get all of those, yeah, Pack the seeds up, and we'll sell this as well. So that guy, I'm going to put the batteries away, and let's grab out our axe, get to chop in. We'll go chop down in cinder sap for now, and then, yeah, maybe around 10.30, we will head off to the Moonlight Jellies. So I'm going to try to talk to everyone at the festival tonight. See how much friendship points we can gain. Oops. But I definitely need a lot more wood. So once Robin is finished with the With our uh, fish bond, I'm going to get the last, the last barn upgrade, which is twenty-five thousand dollars. Hey Lyle, I'll say hi to you when I'm down at the beach. It's going to be twenty-five thousand dollars, so we're going to have to sell some stuff to get to that. Because I'm going to like try to get as much seeds as I can with the money I have right now. Okay, let's head down to the beach. We just need to be there by midnight. Okay, what else do? Yeah, we got 186 pieces of wood. So we should have enough. I think it's 450 for the next barn upgrade. And it's gonna be a few days off still. Hello, Pierre. Can I say hi to you back here? Yes. Let's see what he's selling in his shop. Um, a few things that I would like to get. Oh, sea foam pudding for 5,000. Hey, Caroline. Oh, why is Aiden hiding back here? I did not get too close. They may look beautiful and mysterious, but they are also highly poisonous. Okay. Hey, Jacob. Hey, Louise. How's it going, Pam? Hi, Gus. Moonlight jellies. I wonder how they taste. I would never try it, of course. Sure, Gus. Sure. Life is so easy for a jellyfish, just letting the waves carry you onward forever. Yeah, that would be nice. I want to see the rare green jelly. I thought I saw something moving in there. Something big, something dark. Just trying to scare you. Haha, <laughs> you're so funny, Sebastian. Such a rare and exciting thing. I wonder if they're poisonous. Yeah, they are. They are poisonous. If these jellies don't show in the next 10 minutes, I'm getting out of here. Wasting my evening. Julia. 
Should have brought my camera. I always forget. I can't believe summer's over. I feel like it just started. That's a heavy load of people for an ancient wooden dock. I'll stay over here near the beach. Hey, Jazz. Jody, how's it going? Hi, Emily. Look out there at the endless sea, deep underwater. All kinds of life forms are moving around in the dark. Oh, I think Olivia and Lyle are trying to occupy the same space. The sky is clear tonight. A flawless backdrop of moonlight for the jellies. Wouldn't you say, Melanie B? Oh, look at him! I like how Lyle dresses up for the different events. It's great. <laughs> hey, Victor. These moonlight jellies travel here all the way from across the world. They were at the front islands just a few months ago. I wore my special shoes tonight. No one noticed. Sorry, Clint. Hey, Elliot. Okay, let's say hi to Willie. Let's see, we're on the right side of the beach. There's Joel and Sheila. Oh, there's Sophia. Hey, Susan. Hey, Granny. Hello, George. How's it going? What? Why are you looking at me like that? You think I'm too old to enjoy something like this? No, I just wanted to say hello. Well, summer is over. To be honest, I'll be happy to say goodbye to these people. Oh, okay. So, Harvey doesn't like mosquitoes, I guess. <laughs> Hello, Maru. How's it going? It's kind of cold, actually. I guess fall is right around the corner. It is indeed. Hi, Robin. Linus, I'll just sneak up when the jellies arrive. I don't want to bother anyone. I always wanted to watch the Moonlight Jellies. Now you can. Let's see what the wizard is up to. Hey, wizard. How did you find me back here? I thought I was well hidden. Perhaps you are blessed with the gift of clairvoyance. Perhaps. Perhaps. Okay. Let's get this started. I don't see Marlin here. Okay, Lewis, we're ready. Yeah, go ahead. And off the lantern goes in the boat. And there we see one coming up. See, they are attracted to me, apparently. We even got some baby ones in here, and here comes the green rare jelly. And of course, he's attracted to me, he comes right up to me. The glow of summer has faded now, and the moonlight jellies carry on towards the great unknown. Okay, we're back at the farm now. Put some stuff away. Okay, it's 12.10. Let's get this guy out of the way here. Okay, 
let's see how long our wine has. Two more days. One more day, one and a half days for the for the jelly. Let's get that in the bin. Got quite a bit of gold bars now. So we can upgrade our axe shortly. But let's see how much we have for money for tomorrow. Because we want to get a bunch of seeds. Yeah, 4,000. It's pretty good. Okay, well that is it for this episode. Thank you very much for watching.